The most controversial shift in government's policy on education is now about to bear fruit with the first set of over 1.20 million graduates from academe, vocational training and finishing schools. PTV correspondent Kenneth Pashenta sampled a few of these enthusiastic and abundantly optimistic graduates in this report. Right after the Holy Week, the first batch of students under the K-12 program will finally have their graduation. Based on the data of Department of Education, there are 1,252,357 students who will graduate from senior high school. Most of them come from the academic strand or 61.13% of all graduates. Second largest slice of these graduates who took up technical vocational livelihood course make up 38.32%, while 0.38% held from the arts and 0.17% come from the field of sports. Uh, we are very um, excited because um, this is a major um, program which was started one week earlier by the previous administration and which we supported and um, continued. PTV News team found Quezon City High School already preparing for their forthcoming graduation rites next week. One of them is Cyril. A food and beverages course is what she took when she upon reaching senior high school. And now that she is graduating, she plans to continue her studies in college. Yes, so, kasi pagka-graduate ko, pwede na po akong kumuha ng ano, trabaho agad na makakatulong po sa pamilya ko. Tapos nakapag-prepare na, na rin po ako sa college. According to DepEd, graduates from senior high school did not worry if they plan to pursue their studies in college, especially now that tuition fees in states, universities, and colleges are free. But for Chrisan Tevin, working while studying is feasible and can fit both around each other's schedule. May tatanggap naman din po siguro sa uh, Since napunta naman po kami sa senior high school, um, na parang hinanda na rin po kami na uh, para sa mga works na at nagkaroon na rin po kami ng work immersion. DepEd is confident that majority of the senior high school graduates will pursue their college studies and has high hopes they will eventually find a stable and good paying job. I hope that our concerns about our graduates not finding jobs will be allayed. Uh, this is because the economy has been growing and the demands of economy and industry are also are also increasing Kenneth Pasciente for the nation